So I just moved my panel out to the front of the house, right? I was like, let me take advantage of some of this glorious sun. Come over here, look at the eco flow. Still pulling in 109 watts. I'm like, what in the world? I was telling my man Wayne that slow charge affects solar as well. Let's prove it. I'm gonna go to the app, change over to my device, the EcoFlow, because I don't have it on the internet. Okay, the app. Let's go ahead and refresh that thing. Boom. Slow charge. You can see that it's on. AC slow charge now. <laughs> Turn that off. Watch the magic. There it is, 149 watts. I forgot that this thing was on slow charge. The reason why I put it on slow charge is because I use my myelin to power dump into it. And I don't want it power dumping at 500 watts, which it should be able to anyway, but I had it on slow charge, right? So it could do it moderately at 100 watts. So I've basically been getting less power on this EcoFlow all day because slow charge not only affects the AC, it affects the solar. It is I've holla.